Prayer is a means to communicate with God and settling issues of life. These were the words of Priscilla Gideon and Michael Lockie while preaching on prevailing through prayers at Assemblies of God Church in Agua. Well, the only thing that can make we all prevail in this world, it is prayer. You must hold on firmly to God. He alone is the author and the finisher of our faith. I urge every one of us to pray in this manner, a kind of prayer, a broken-hearted prayer. That is a prevailing prayer. Pastor Gary Akepre of Calvary Grace Power Ministries and Manson Kolime of Jesus Freedom Ministries preached on a message titled, Let God Step In and Work for God. They advise Christians to be dedicated to the service of God, always to receive the inherent blessings from serving God. When God steps into your matter, no matter the condition you are facing, difficulties of things, things will change and we need God to step into our matter. Just follow God's direction, His commitment. You will be saved. You will be blessed. At Christian Pentecostal Mission Okaka, Selei Perehapi preached on deliverance from the hands of the wicked ones, urged Christians to be conscious of the enemies around them and always take prayer seriously to overcome the antics of the devil. I want every Christian to study the word of God and pray so that the enemy will not have an edge over you. At Altar of Fire International Church Okaka, Evangelist Elaweremi Ezoa enjoined believers to keep their faith alive, build trust in the Lord, and to always call on God in times of tribulations. This was captured in a message titled, Your Healing is Now. My, my advice to believers out there is that uh, we should build our absolute trust in the Lord by faith. Uh, whatever the Lord has purposed in his heart to do for us, he will do it no matter the time it may take because delay can never be denial in the sight of god hallelujah church service witness praises <laughs> in yenagua voke bari nta news